Crazy video coming from an eyewitness who was just trying to eat dinner at a fast food restaurant in the Montrose area. That's when a man who was being vulgar got into a fight with customers and another worker. Eyewitness News reporter Stephen Romo is live at that Burger King with more on that video. Stephen? <laughs> Yeah, Tom, it is a pretty unbelievable sight that happened inside this. Tom Cook, only on 13 Eyewitness News this morning. Crazy video coming from an eyewitness who was just trying to eat dinner at a fast food restaurant in the Montrose area. That's when a man who was being vulgar got into a fight with customers and another worker. Eyewitness News reporter Stephen Romo is live at that Burger King with more on that video. Stephen? <laughs> Yeah, Tom, it is a pretty unbelievable sight that happened inside this Burger King here in the Montrose area, and it keeps getting shocking as each second goes by. Let's take a look at that video. You can see that man starts off shoving items off the counter and then gets into a physical fight with a man inside. There's a shoving and then a punch. The man ends up on the floor and then a woman approaches and she appears to have a stun gun that she lifts up his shirt and appears to, to use on him a couple times. It's not clear exactly what effect it has on the man, but obviously this is getting a lot of attention in the restaurant. Uh, we can hear the, the bleeping there from all the language being used. Finally, that man leaves the store and he appears to take some type of cart with him. And the person who is taking this video uh, tells us just what an unbelievable sight it was. She was uh, trying to eat dinner there when all this broke out in front of her. Uh, it's not yet clear if the police responded to this. We're trying to figure out exactly what happened from that end. We're also trying to figure out who this man was, if he's known to the people in this restaurant. We haven't been able to get a comment yet from that restaurant. If we're able to gather more information, we'll, of course, bring that to you. Reporting live in Montrose, Stephen Romo, 13 Eyewitness News.